Hey everybody, I've been out here fishing on Pretty Boy Reservoir for carp tonight. The Brood 10 cicadas are out. They come out once every 17 years, and when they do, the carp have a feeding frenzy. So I don't normally fish for carp, but under these circumstances, it's a lot of fun because I can catch them on top water using light tackle, and then they go crazy, and i got to try to land them. So we went out tonight for about an hour. We caught four of them. So I got it all on video. Hope you enjoy. doesn't seem too big. It's the first one of the evening. Out here carp fishing again. The 17 year cicadas are out and when they are the carp feed really actively on the surface. So I'm out here using a head and tiny torpedo. I'm using a five and a half foot pan, uh, lightning rod with eight pound test. I got the motor in reverse right now. I'm pulling us away from shore. Once I get this out into a little deeper water, I'll probably be able to manage it a little better. It's still gonna take me a little while to tire it out. This one's considerably smaller than the one I caught yesterday. No, maybe not. Now that I'm looking at him, that's a pretty good sized carp. Another good one. Definitely got to put the motor in reverse for this one. That one's not too bad, a little bit smaller. Still a lot of fun.
this one feels pretty big too. Right, that makes number two in the boat. And I've only been here about half an hour so far. All right, not sure I'm gonna get him out of the net here. That's another nice one. This one feels pretty big, but I haven't seen it yet. It just went straight down and it's going down deep. I've seen some really big ones swimming around. Some that I almost don't want to hook into because I don't know what I would do if I hooked them. And this could be one of them, who knows. Pretty good size. And we're back where we started. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that's a pretty big one. Uh, let me see if he's ready for the net yet.
this is definitely the biggest one yet today. Boy, that is heavy. Oh, the hook wasn't even actually in him. It was just on him. As soon as I touched it, it just fell away from his mouth. If I had ever for a moment let up pressure, he would have just spit that hook right out of its mouth. Wow, I can't believe I caught him. Oh yeah, he's definitely a good one. All right, everybody, that's number four for the evening. So I think we are gonna call that a day. I'm gonna start heading on back to the boat launch, go home and get me some dinner. So I'm gonna say thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you real soon on the next one.